This video is going to be a brief tutorial on how to import and export projects in the Godot Engine version 2.1. Included either in the description box below if you're watching this on YouTube or hopefully somewhere else with the video will be a file called space shooter onezip Its contents should include the space shooter one file, which actually include the game files that we use to make the space shooter game that we did. If you also watch the Godot introductory tutorial that I also made. What you're going to do here is take the uh, space shooter one folder inside the zip file, copy that, and just paste it wherever it is you store your Godot projects. In my case, it's in the Godot projects folder. Go ahead and close that window. And then open Godot. And once you have that open, click the import button in the right menu. Then you're going to browse and then path over to wherever you have those files, where you put those files, excuse me. In my case, it's in programming Godot projects. Here's the space shooter. And then I'm going to click on the engine.config file. And that is essential for importing any project into Godot. If you don't have that file, you won't be able to do uh, an import. And once you hit the import button here, here it is. Here is our space shooter game that we did in the tutorial. Everything is the same, of course. The, re the renaming of the nodes has stayed intact as well as all of these scripts we created. And if I go over to the scene that contains this enemy, wrong scene, there we go. You can also see that all of these signals, nodes, and groups, oops, sorry, and the uh, groups, there we go, and groups that we assigned all of the objects have stayed intact as well. If you, for whatever reason, would like to change or uh, import a script, into an object, let's say uh, you're doing a group project and someone has sent you an updated version of the script and you don't want to copy and paste it. Uh, for example, so I'm just gonna clear the script off of the enemy. I'm gonna hit attach script. And uh, let's say we start in this file, right? I'm going to go navigate to wherever I put that script file in. It should be .gd because that's a .gd script file. I'm just gonna click on this. It's gonna, it should prompt you that you're loading an existing script. And as we do so, voila. So that's how you would import a script that you already have. Of course, again, it does have to be a .gd file. When exporting a project in Godot, you're gonna have to do a little bit of a, a little bit of a, um, you're gonna have to go through a couple of steps. The first one is that you will need to install the export templates. These can be downloaded from the Godot uh, webpage itself. I'm gonna go ahead and show you that is exactly on the Godot downloads page. Again, this should be linked somewhere. It would be this, the export templates. You want to download that. And then you're going to want to install these export templates. Now I'm going to have to back up considerably here because I believe I just left mine in my downloads folder. And I did. Once that has finished loading, you may now export your project. I'm going to go ahead and use the Windows desktop. I'm not going to necessarily use the Windows Universal Media Platform at this specific moment. Okay. So we're going to have, I'm just going to go ahead and dis disable the debugger and leave all these options as normal. And then I'm going to hit export. Uh, let's go ahead and name our uh, executable here, and I'm just going to call it the space shooter. Press OK. And that should have done. Go ahead and check out where I hopefully have saved it. Find the executable. And there we go. Our simple space shooter game exported as a Windows executable file. Hopefully you found this tutorial helpful, and I hope you all have a great day.